Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Oathbound Warlock. I'm Warlock, and let's get into some airsoft. Today, I'll be showing you the second game from our last game day at Camp Longrider, my home field in Sydney, Arkansas. This will be a game of VIP. The teams will start on opposite sides of the map, with the VIP located in the middle. Each team's objective is to escort the VIP to an extraction zone about 75 feet north of the enemy team's spawn. It'll be a tough ask. Let's get into it. So we're putting together a little strategy, but uh, we had a new admin today and there was a little confusion as to whether or not the game was actually started or not. Go! Just making sure people are running, so we're taking off. My plan was to kind of head towards the middle, try and get to that VIP first. Obviously that didn't happen. Since we're starting off on the back foot, I'm just gonna try and lay down some fire, see if I can't get some enemies knocked out. While in the meantime, maybe getting my teammates up there to potentially get that VIP. They're dug in pretty tight, but I'm hoping with weight of fire, we can potentially knock some of them out. I got at least three teammates right behind me on that other side of the wall there in Poseidon. Lost one of my wingmen. I got my two primary targets there in that window and right next to that building. Lost another one of my wingmen. Got one of them down in that far building over there. Hit. They finally got me. Let's regroup and come at them from a different angle. We're picking up after I respawned. I headed a little bit further north. I'm kind of right on the corner of the map. I'm making sure they don't push towards their objective. I'm kind of holding it down. I told my teammates what I was doing, so that way they can potentially push forward in other areas. Tried to get a couple shots on that enemy, but the brush is just too dense. Figured I may as well just hold it down here. That way if they push, at least I'm here to push back. Accuracy wasn't quite what I wanted on that exchange, but is what it is. Spent way too much ammo on that exchange. That may bite me later. Mermaid, move to Green Acres! Trying to get my teammates moving. I'm actually going to fall back. I'm going to head to the objective that the enemy is trying to get their VIP to. Figure they're making a big push. May as well be where they're wanting to be. And here we go. There's that expenditure ammo coming to bite me. But luckily I got a little surprise in store for him. I'm using this wall to my left as cover. That was a grenade. First time that guy had ever been hit with a grenade, so hopefully he'll remember that in the future. All right, looks like we pushed him back for now. I'm getting some support from my team. Nice shot. Unbeknownst to me, though. Yep, I got you. The enemy team was sneaking around to the south, coming up past our spawn point. I'm running low on ammo. Going to get my grenade. Ah, hit, hit, hit. Actually gets me killed. We're gonna respawn and come at him from a different angle. See what we can do. All right, we're back from respawn at the point where I just died. 
working with my team a little bit. Heathen, Mara, if y'all want to hold here, I'll move up into Green Acres. Chip and I are going to head along this northern path here, head a little bit deeper into the field, see if we can spot the VIP or potentially take out some enemies along the way. This is still Chip's first day out. So far, he's doing a great job. He's being a little squirrely running around the field. You good, Chip? I'm gonna move into that building on yourself. Green Acres is quickly becoming one of my favorite spots on the map. It's fun to attack, it's fun to defend. Never mind. Well, at least the enemy knows we're here. We just need to find where the enemy is. No shot. Watch this way. Alright, I'm gonna move into that building. Chip's doing a pretty good job watching my six. I'm gonna go ahead and move forward into, I believe this is uh, Wesson House. Found him. I'm gonna try and lay down some fire, potentially draw him to me. On my M4 here, I'm actually running a tracer unit, even though I'm not running tracer BBs. I just, I like the way it looks. People say it gives away my position, but I'm okay with it. Because if they're focused on me, it means they may potentially miss somebody else. A lot of movement over there in Town Hall. I'm thinking the VIP's either in Town Hall or they're trying to get the VIP to Town Hall. I'm just kind of watching, waiting. Popping off some shots when I'm able. Yeah, they got me pretty well zeroed. Time to take some cover. Almost shot the admin right there. That's always a good sound to hear when you're in cover. They're dug in pretty good. It's hard to get an enemy team out once they're in town hall. Where are they, Chip? Where are they? Blind man! Blind man is what we call if somebody on the field ever has to remove their eye protection, the game stops until the alt and clear is given. And there it is. A lot of scrambling. I'm pretty sure they just grabbed the VIP right there. They're moving south towards Roadhouse with the VIP. I'm gonna try and start making my way south to potentially head them off. Because if they're heading south with the VIP in my head, it means they're gonna make a run towards Mermaid and then up north. Not the way I'd do it, but it is what it is. Another mag down. There goes my wingman. Looks like they're falling back pretty hard. Watching the video back, it's pretty clear they're forming up for a big advance down south. I'm gonna start making my way towards Poseidon. See if I can potentially reinforce them down that way. Just 
making sure nobody's in that part of the map. Might be kind of hard to tell in the video, but I'm seeing probably four or five, maybe even six people off there in those trees. Fortunately, I can't get a shot off. So, I'm going to try and flank towards the middle of the map. I'm going to head more towards the middle, towards Town Hall, and potentially head south. At the very least, if the VIP gets killed, I'll be there waiting for him. I got Chip behind me, but I'm telling him to hold off because I saw some movement there in Town Hall. All I can see is a knee. Got her. Looks like the enemy team left, uh, left a defender there in Town Hall to potentially head us off. Ooh, they left another defender there in the bank. Can't get a shot on her from there. All right, so now we own Town Hall. Got another enemy moving up from their spawn. Waiting for him to get a little closer. He didn't know I was there. I got at least two enemies prone off there in those woods. Going prone is a really good strategy on our field. All the under undergrowth and the way the, the BBs hop really works to your advantage. Chip got one of them. I think he's over here with this group. They're going to be coming from this way. Keep an eye. That's Frost. We got enemy moving up from our north. Right over that way. Oh, nope. Kaz is a master of the tactical advance. Chip's trying to warn me. Yep. A little too late. We'll see what we can do on the next one. Moving up towards Town Hall again. I'm already clocking an enemy across the field. I'm almost out of ammo. Let's see if we can uh, take out a couple more before I'm out of the game. At? Our team finally got the VIP. I'm almost out, so I'm going to try and take out some enemies before I'm done. Finally got him. This warlock, I'm almost out of ammo. A couple of guys on my team are running comms. Figure I'd just let them know. Really need to conserve ammo here, but I'm more focused on knocking the enemy back. There's Kaz again. I'm out of ammo. Well, that's me out. Catch you guys on the next video. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video, guys. If you like what I'm doing here, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channel. That way you can stay locked in on what I'm doing. And as always, hope to see y'all on the airsoft field.